You're retired, the market crashes, how do you pay your bills? Hi, I'm Robin Dolezal and this is Alex Pars and together we are with Ironwood Financial here in Tucson, Arizona. We run into lots of people who are retired who aren't prepared for the next market crash, who are dependent upon their portfolio to help them pay their bills. Unfortunately, we can't call the electric company and have them wait a year until the market corrects itself until we can pay them. So how do we set up our portfolio in a way that allows us to pay our bills, take an income, even when a market crashes? So let's talk about that today. That's actually a very good question and something that we see very few people are actually set up to weather the next crash. So you actually need to do this, of course, before it happens. After the market crashes, it's too late. And it's a very simple procedure. <clears throat> what you need to do is you need to match your expenses with your portfolio. And what I mean by that is match the time frames of what you're going to spend with when you need to spend it. Okay, and then you need to take your investments and make sure that they're allocated appropriately for those time horizons. For example, you need to have some money set aside, not just an emergency reserve account, but actually the money that you plan on spending in the next few years. And you need to make sure that those are invested in investments that are not too aggressive. Okay, because if the market crashes, you still have to pay those bills. So you put that money in that short term area in money that you can access if you need to, even in a crash. And then you get the next section that you put for maybe five to 10 years out. And that money you can be a little more aggressive with and it can take some ups and downs and maybe even during a crash lose 10, 20%. But you can't be too aggressive with it because you need to make sure that it's there when the time comes. And then finally, whatever is left over, you can put away in the long-term pile. And that money is money that you can be more aggressive with because you don't need to touch it for quite some time. And as history has shown us, the markets tend to do pretty well when you give them enough time. For more information, check out our website, ironwoodfinancial.com, or give us a call if you want to sit down, 520-318-4600. Thanks for watching.